a moving tribute tonight to Carly Bowden, a nurse murdered in the parking lot of the hospital where she worked. The Bel Canto Chorus honored Carly at their performance tonight. She sang with the group for years before she was killed in January. Our Mary Jo Ola live outside the Basilica of St. Josephat. Mary Jo. Yeah, Carol, tonight's performance was beautiful but bittersweet, being that Carly Bowden was supposed to be up there with the Bel Canto Chorus. Instead, her husband and her family sat in the audience unable to hear her sing. As the bel canto chorus filled the Basilica of St. Joseph at with music Friday night, the singers were missing Carly Bowden. She was a soprano with us in the chorus. She was just such a beautiful person inside and out, and when she walked in the room, everything just felt lighter and brighter. Carly was a trained opera singer. This is our way to thank her for bringing that into our life and also give a peaceful farewell for her as well. In January, Carly was killed outside Freighter Hospital. She worked there as a nurse practitioner. There are bad nights and there are good ones. We caught up with Carly's husband, Nick, on Skype. He says Carly's singing was the first thing he noticed about her. The nine minute concert, that was stuff that brought Carly a lot of peace and a lot of happiness. It's something she loved, so it's going to be a really good thing uh, to experience. The Bel Canto Chorus says music has helped in their grief. This time, it celebrates Carly's life. Now, right before the chorus sang a song in Carly's honor, her husband shared a few words, sharing a few fond memories of their life together. Organizers say 400 people bought tickets for tonight's performance. Reporting live outside the Basilica of St. Joseph at Mary Joola, today's TMJ4. Yeah, it had to be poignant, but very emotional. Mary Jo, thank you very much for that.